how much do we care about the future of our planet? Are we really concerned with our future and that of our children and grandchildren? These are important questions for any age, but particularly today. Our planet is at a crossroads and we face a number of key issues. Climate change and its consequences, an energy crisis, along with concerns about the security of our energy supplies and the costs of investing in new power stations. There are, however, many reasons to be optimistic about the future. New and convincing paradigms relating to clean, renewable energy are emerging quickly. A world in which solar, wind and other sustainable forms of energy generation, along with hydrogen storage, are set to revolutionize the way our energy is produced and distributed. Linked to this new world, and in itself another reason for optimism, is the case for energy efficient lighting. Today, 19% of all electricity generated worldwide is used for lighting. And there are two key facts to remember. Firstly, that about two thirds of all lighting installed in the world today is energy inefficient. It's based on technologies developed before 1970. And secondly, that during the past decade, there's been a revolution in lighting. New technologies can provide energy savings of up to 80% whilst also providing better quality light. This means people feel better and are more productive. If the world were to switch from the older to the newer lighting technologies, it would save 120 billion euros per year in running costs or 630 million tons of carbon. The technologies to achieve these savings already exist today for all market segments and the benefits are huge. Reasons to switch to energy efficient lighting include saving money, reducing carbon emissions, reducing the load on power stations and reducing investment costs in new ones, providing higher quality light which means productivity and well-being gains and demonstrating leadership in green. And the new lighting technologies to make these savings exist today. Alternatives for the incandescent light bulb in the home include CFL lamps, energy savings 80%, Eco Classic Halogen, 50% energy savings, Master LED, 80% savings. In buildings, the use of new TL5 fluorescent systems alongside electronic ballasts and lighting controls can save up to 75%. On our roads, new lighting control systems can cut energy consumption for road lighting by 50% or more. Whilst in our shops, new compact HID lighting can replace halogen and compact fluorescent lighting, saving up to 80%. High-quality LEDs are now also appearing for office lighting. The new Philips Fortimo LED system, for example, offers a 50% energy saving when compared to fluorescent downlights. This is a real breakthrough and is the start of things to come. And energy-efficient lighting can be controlled. Lights can be switched off or down when nobody's present and natural daylight can be used to compensate artificial lighting. This will also support future visions of intelligent power grids and the idea of buildings as energy hubs. Controls offer realistic additional savings of up to 50% and we should bear in mind that today only a tiny fraction of our buildings use lighting controls of any kind. But by far the biggest savings potential lies in the refurbishment of the older existing lighting schemes, particularly in buildings. Private and public sector buildings, for example, account for about 60% of all lighting used around the world today, and most of them still use older, inefficient lighting. Why not check out your organization's buildings and do an audit? Today, imaginative new business models can provide initial financing with the investment costs being quickly repaid from the resulting energy savings. And governments can play a role here by considering fiscal incentives to help speed up this renovation rate. 
the reduction of energy consumption for lighting also fits nicely with a future vision of buildings as mini power plants in their own right, allowing more energy to be transferred to the grid. But you might ask, if there's a need and the solutions exist, what's the problem? The main issue is that the current switchover rate to energy efficient lighting is too slow. For example, in buildings in the EU, it's 7% per year, or for road lighting, only 3% per year. At this rate, it will take another 30 years to benefit from today's savings. There is also still not enough awareness with people and organizations that energy efficient lighting will also save you a huge amount of money during its lifetime. Often new lighting technologies initially cost a little more, but save very significant amounts of money during their lifetimes. For example, a CFL energy saver that costs say 3 euros to buy appears to be more expensive for the consumer than a 50 cent incandescent light bulb. However, during the lifetime of the CFL energy saver, the consumer will save up to 60 euros in electricity costs. This principle holds true for all energy efficient lighting today. People and organizations who choose the cheapest initial purchase are therefore actually buying the most expensive solution and they're also placing a burden on our energy infrastructure with all the consequences. Energy efficient lighting offers a triple win. The consumer or company gains because of fast cost savings on their energy bill and from better quality lighting. The environment wins because the demand for electricity is reduced and the economic competitiveness of a country or region is strengthened. So, how can we speed up the switch to energy efficient lighting today and make an impact for the future? In December 2006, Philips became the first lighting company to call for a phase out of incandescent light bulbs and since then many governments around the world have taken action and are preparing legislation for lighting based on setting minimum performance criteria. This has now gained significant global momentum and relevance. The list includes Today, regional leadership in this area can still be claimed. Philips is looking to be your partner in this switch. Join us in tackling this issue achieve more energy savings and discover the many benefits for your own organization, your home and for the planet your children and grandchildren will live on. Energy efficient lighting is part of the solution to both climate change and the energy crisis. It will also help speed up the revolution towards a new world energy order in which renewable energy sources will radically change the way our energy supplies are produced and distributed. It's a simple switch to make and the world needs to switch, because a sustainable world, a world fit for our children and grandchildren, is a world that only uses energy-efficient lighting solutions.